This segment brought to you by Kansas Farm Bureau, the voice of agriculture. To join today or more information, go to kfb.org or find us on Facebook and Twitter. Welcome back to Farm Factor and the Kansas Farm Bureau Update. Efforts to modernize and improve trade through the North American Free Trade Agreement, along with discussions with China, are continuing as U.S. agriculture seeks certainty. Negotiators are meeting this week in Washington, D.C. to discuss NAFTA and American Farm Bureau Federation Senior Director of Congressional Relations Dave Salmonson says negotiators must quickly conclude the talks regarding auto rules before moving on to other issues, including dairy. As is usual with trade negotiations, once the hardest issue issues get done, some of these other issues can move on and get settled, but they've got to get to it. So they're under some time pressure. Unless an agreement is basically concluded by the end of May, it's hard to see how it will have the amount of time necessary to go through all the processes required so there can be a vote in Congress by the end of this year. Meanwhile, the talks will continue with China next week as China and the U.S. seek a resolution to multiple trade issues which have sparked potential tariffs against U.S. agriculture. A U.S. delegation traveled to China last week and the talks will continue next week in the United States. As a result of that, will we then not have the need for tariffs? Or if the talks aren't all that successful, maybe tariffs and potential retaliation by China against U.S. ag products that may go ahead later this year. So a lot riding on these discussions between the U.S. and China. Farmers and ranchers need market certainty from both efforts, according to Salmonson. What we're looking at is certainty. The whole discussion of tariffs, whether from NAFTA, if that doesn't turn out well, and especially with China, the potential threat of retaliation. So we want trade to be much more certain on a basis where we know we'll have those markets open and farmers can count on that as an outlet for their crops. Michael Clements, Washington. Stay with us. We'll be back after the break with Plain Talk. Sure Crop Fertilizers was started by my father, Don Sherman, and my mother, Shirley Sherman. Family business has started in the 80s. We predominantly focus on plant nutrients and what we can do to give growers better responses for with the fertilizer dollars that they do and what we can do to you know, make those things work better for the grower. We're based out of Seneca, Kansas, we work with growers in their soil analysis to figure out what they need and then we can put those in a blend that gives them the best results and so that we can deliver that direct to their farm so that they have those nutrients where they need them, when they need them, and so that they can apply them in a manner that's, that's very efficient to them and, and works well on their planting systems and what they're doing. Sure Crop Fertilizers has been around for a long time. We always say we're, we're big enough to take care of everything you need, but yet we're small enough to do it quickly. You can get a hold of us at 1-800-635-4743. Um, our website is surecropfertilizers.com. And you can always email me at corey at surecropfertilizers.com. And with any questions you have, we'd be glad to answer and work with you. 